We're going to Pasadena and Santa Monica today. Let's go. Here we are at Pasadena. My studio, which was also called a wind tunnel, is up there. We do have a free valet parking, so you can just leave your car with the valet and then we just do all the hard work for you and just you just focus on your schoolwork and keep designing. Graduate media design practices, which was my major. And you notice this giant wall up here is actually a door because this is an actual wind tunnel. This is where they used to test the aerodynamics of the um, aircraft like the wing the profile see which one is more um, efficient um, to fly uh, since I've graduated I don't know if I can still have access but let's give it a shot this is another main building and these plants are all new which is interesting and in this way you see this giant staircase that takes you up to the rooftop How is this possible? I got in. Okay. Insane. I'm a, I'm a bit excited but also scared. To the right, this is our maker space. You have the circuit board, Miller, 3D printer over there, and then a storing station, more computers. It seems like they changed the VR space to here. Plotter, photo booth. Yeah, I have to say it has got almost everything that you need to make your project successful are all the seats uh, for each individual student nostalgic on the right is a classroom slash meeting room area walls for pinup critics conversation happened here this is the faculty office this is another classroom over there studio one this whole space is for guests because some of the exhibition event that we host that's a quick tour of my studio and if you look up you will actually see the ceiling the super tall super high second floor it's a viewport type of thing that you can see my whole studio from above and he's over there videotaping me videotaping him Uh, Hillside campus is closed today for Labor Day weekend and Lewis is very sad about it <laughs> It's okay. At least we get to see the South Campus, so that's good enough. Yeah, I'm actually surprised that the South Campus is open but not the Hillside campus Next well, time. Early brunch, so yep. Some update and changes. Earth Cafe has a, an hour wait, so we are in this very decorative, cozy zone of Rosa Cafe. And more importantly, we have these lovely designer friends acting super awkwardly. <laughs> <laughs> so we have um, Han from Industrial Design, Louis, you know who Louis is, and Octave <laughs> in transportation, and Annie is hiding behind the camera over here. Um, we're all here designing a better future. So. We booked, but we have reservations, so we're good. Finally, we got here. Super exciting! So this is the Ames House, designed by our famous and influential industrial design couples Charles and Ray Ames, who essentially defined the way of modern living. So this house was influenced by the Dutch art movement called the Style, which translates into the Style in English. So this style advocates the pure abstraction in the form and color to their essence. So you will essentially see a, a lot of horizontal lines, vertical lines, and black white and the primary colors as the main visual language extremely clean extremely geometric such a masterpiece you have to come here and see in person but remember make a reservation because they don't allow walk-in
absolutely incredible. So you can also take this little path or trail that takes you behind it and around the house. Yeah, pretty incredible. If you come to LA, you have to come here and see it. Yeah, Ames House, highly, highly recommended. We spent about two hours here, so plan your schedule accordingly. And now, since we're so close to Santa Monica Beach, we're gonna go there, have a drink, take a break, and then head to the airport. Hello, Santa Monica. Look at the back, 66 sign. It's always this busy, no matter which day, which season, even though today is the Labor Day, it's still like this. Super hot, but you have got the awesome beach, the awesome boardwalk, a lot of vendors, a lot of food, a lot of anything, performances happening. You can just spend hours of hours here, especially we have got the, uh, hey, hello. We have got various weird roller coaster things that you wish to do. Perfect place to chill out and especially at the end of summer, right? That's the place to go. Unfortunately, we don't have too much time to spend here, so we just take this boat walk and on our way back, grab a drink, and then we have to head to the airport. Time to go back to San Francisco. So that's it for today and the end of the trip. So don't forget to comment down below, like, subscribe, share. See you next trip. Cheers.